WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi folks, this is Basil Chapman at the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network. A market update. Dow is down. Let me just check it out. Now it's up. It's up 6 at 34,982. I just wanted to show you here the E-mini. Look, the, my, my expression is that a rectangle formation can last a lot longer than your patience. Look, the E-mini since 9.30 has the S&P has traded between 43.59 and 43.39. All this time, it's had little uh, ups and downs, a little zigzagging, and yet it's still stuck within that range. So it has to break that range to really show some upside capacity. We're looking at, uh, just real quickly, I'll give it to you, the Dow needs to break. It's at 34,544. Uh, it needs to trade in 34,610 uh, area or higher, and that'll be a good sign for the close today. The S&P at this particular point, the S&P is trading. We're talking about, oh, I hit the wrong button. S&P is trading uh, up 77 cents at 43.61. It needs to get to 43. It's got a lot of ways to go. 43.77, 43.82 level to say, hey, I'm now going to try to go to the upper range. Uh, and we'll see what happens. Needs to hold 43, 40 support, that's for sure. QQQ has been lagging, still lagging. QQQs are down 63 cents at 357. We're looking at struggle, struggle, struggle. It's going to continue to struggle, I believe, for a little while to come. And the Q, the IWM, the Russell 2000, is trading. It's it also within a range, very small range. It is up 1.38 and it needs to get to the 223 area to say it's got internal strength. Looking at the TLT, this is important. First time you've had a decent bounce, it's trying to, it's struggling to hold the bounce. I don't know if it can, but what's really important is that you've got gold at this particular point holding most of its gain. It's up seven or eight dollars right now, 1763. It needs to hold for an hour and a half today in the 1770, what did I say it was? 1771 area. That would be a positive. If can't do that, it's just going to be struggling. The dollar is holding quite nicely. The dollar is up. It's at a new recovery high. I, I, we remain along the dollar. I still think it's going to be going higher. And if you're looking at crude oil, crude oil is finally taking a bit of a breather instead of being up two dollars as usual it's only up 21 cents at 80.73 i think there's a one more, more pop to go and then it takes a bit of a breather stay tuned you got larry perseventa should be a wonderful program as always with larry you've got steve Rhodes, same thing and then you've got dave white and then tom o'brien this afternoon i'll actually be back with tom later this afternoon have a wonderful day and make sure that you stay tuned to tfnn and see you tomorrow